Yn nod i, mewn gwirioni, ddi ddod ar dwnod i ben i rhannu gyda chi uh, y weled egeu sydd ar gyfer yr athrofa. Mae chi wedi cael blas heddiw o rhen sydd ganddyn ni ar y gweill, a da chi wedi profi siaradwyr arbennig o ddadwyr i wedi neistedd mewn sawl cynhadledd yn ynghymnod i fel, fel pennaeth. Yn gobeithio bod chi'n rhannu gyda fi mae hon i bod yn wahanol, mae wedi bod yn fywiog, mae wedi bod yn greadigol, a mae wedi bod yn eangfrydig, a mae hwnna'n fod yn rhan allweddol o, o genhadaeth uh, yr athrofa. Dan ni sôn am genhadaeth, nawn ni gyfle threni ychydig, mae yn gyfle, cyfle sydd gyda ni, cyfle i wneud gwahaniaeth. Mae, mae, mae'n anrhydedd fy mod i'n gallu arwain a bod yn rhan o'r athrofa hon sy'n mynd i greu'r cyfle arbennig yma. Beth mae'n cymhelliant ni? Wel, yn cymhelliant ni ydy darparu'r gora i ddisgyblion Cymru ac o'r herwydd i athrawon yn Cymru. Os nawn ni hynny, fi allwn ni wneud gwahaniaeth, fi allwn ni draws newid bod wedi a thraws newid addysg yng Nghymru. Sut dan ni'n mynd i wneud o? Dan ni'n mynd i wneud o drwy gydweithredu. Cydweithrediad yn bwysig, bwysig yn iawn. Mae'n ddigon o bobl y gwmpas y byd yma ac yn ymwlad hon wedi, wedi dweud i dweud, wedi tygatgan i barn, ond ddim gyda'r bwriad o gydweithredu a neisio bod ni gyd gyda'n gilydd yn llwyddo. My, my, my purpose at the end of this fantastic day is to share with you a mission, uh, as Peter has, has noted in the programme. But it's not our mission, hopefully it's your mission as well. Um, we are aiming to participate in the process of transforming education and tr transforming lives in Wales. Interesting, when we visited Harvard, both Peter and I, we, we met with the Dean of Education there, and, and as we walked in, their mantra, their mission statement was learning to change the world. Well, we just heard the reason for that today, and especially towards the end of the presentation with, with Kate and, and Andrew. That's what we need to do. We need to create a climate where we are learning to change, change the world. As, uh, as David said earlier on this morning, we, we want to create our own weather to make sure that we, we influence and we change things in Wales as, as we can. How are we going to do that? Well, he, he mentioned an alliteration. He, he mentioned a lot of the P's this morning. Um, it will be done with pride because there is, has been a tendency, and as I had teacher uh, until last December, I just felt there is not enough celebration of the good work that is actually happening already in the schools in Wales. And we need to be proud of the, the good work that's happening and build upon that. That pride needs to be certain, that pride needs to be secure, and we, we must move forward in embodying that pride and making sure that we develop that pride further. The place he mentioned, well the place is Wales, but we're not gonna have a parochial, inward-looking system or a thrower. We're going to have a, 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 a thrower which looks outward. We've talked about the Welsh Edu Education Commission. You've heard today about the, pe the speakers that we bring in to bear on our and to influence our, our philosophy and our ethos and our values. It's going to be an outward looking uh, and one that's willing to listen to those who know better. I mentioned that a good leader always recognises that you're not necessarily the most intelligent or the most important person in the room. And if ever I get to a situation why I'm starting to preach the other P, that tends to happen a lot and has happened over the last 15 years in Wales, the so-called experts preaching at schools, preaching at teachers, we're not gonna do that. If I do that, let me know soon enough and we need to change our ways because we're not gonna do that. It has to be through partnership, the other P that's been mentioned a lot. We have to do it through partnership, partnership with schools. And we, we definitely want to position ourselves on that horizontal axis that David mentioned this morning. We want to be in the thick of it. I don't know if that's the right terminology, given the swearing and whatever goes on that program, but we want to be in the middle, working with, influencing, yes, on the balcony, yes, bringing the research elements to bear, which, you, which is the key element of the Athrawa, Athrawa assessment, leadership, language across the curriculum, and so on, but we want to be on the dance floor as well. Hopefully not doing any dad dancing, but we want to be key in the dance floor, as he mentioned. We put, we're in the middle of it, in the classroom, working with teachers, which is so, so important for us. And please excuse a, a footballer making use of the Euros, but it is relevant, I think, even if you take Leicester uh, as, as the example, good teams, good teamwork can win things. Um, and we want Wales to be the best team possible, and we want to make the best possible contribution to that team. You've heard, I don't know whether you're aware, um, you may not be, but the before now, before the hashtag, the motto of the Welsh FA has been Gorai Chwarai, Cyd Chwarai. You win if you play together, if you work together. 
It is now transferred into a hashtag, Together Stronger. Well, if they're not an example how a small nation, by working together, by getting the best out of each other, then surely we can do that and lead the way and making a contribution as a thrower. That's our mission. We aim to succeed, and we aim to succeed together, because it is always better together. Diolch eich eich, presenoldeb heddiw, diolch am bob peth, mae'n gyflach eich 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 eich